my blender tutorial and it will be about the terrain I warn you this one's gonna be short because if I put it all into one it'll go over my time and I want the most important stuff to be in one bulk so this one won't be too long but anyway start out open up blender and then you have your cube or hopefully you already have your FPS I'm gonna open up what we've been working on my FPS tutorial see I've worked on it a little bit giving some color I had the reset the reset plane I figured out for it to work properly you have to save your file because it's restarting the file that's how it's saved it's just restarting to the default so alright you have your FPS or catch up to here from my previous tutorials and you can either use the new plane or use the one that you already have either way edit mode and then go into this little tab right there this button down here fractal that divides it subdivides it randomly and kind of crumples it up you could say do that till you're somewhat pleased I'll warn you if you do it too much it starts to take up memory so I'm probably going to do that last one and then uh, bring that down a little bit so that you're not like cutting off your gun and then speaking of gun to make that so it's not just like floating around without physics like that bullet at the very beginning of my last tutorial what you want to do go over to the logics and then don't make it rigid body because that if you do it will fall over what you want to do is you want to make it dynamic so it will have gravity but it won't have like it won't fall left and right I guess I could say so now you got a really basic terrain go back into objects object mode and then add a modifier and then go up to the very top Fix subsurf. What this is gonna do is go sub like uh, smooth it out. You can already tell. Big difference. And then you can adjust like how smooth. But once again, the more smooth, the more it's gonna take up. So depending on your computer, you might want more or less. So now you got a very, very basic terrain, and I guess I can afford a fractal it one more time select it all fractal no no that seems alright for now but anyway as I said before pretty short tutorial for now it's actually going to be a two part this is a little bit so you got your small little level the next one or the next part in this one is how to like sculpt you're going to sculpt your little terrain to make it a little more detailed I'll make some cracks, crevices, hills, mountains, stuff like that. So, jump on over to the next one and we continue from there. But for now, that's it.